Hello everyone, today, since it's Halloween, um, oh yeah, happy Halloween by the way, um, hope you all enjoy yours, um, I'm going to be reviewing the Ultimate Michael Myers from NECA Studios, from also Halloween 2 as well, um, but yeah, um, first off, here's the figure himself, in all his Michael Myers glory, the, the knife he has is from the Ultimate, NECA Ultimate Ghostface, it just, I think it looks pretty cool with him, but yeah, um, we'll get on to his accessories and then, uh, the, the articulation. So, first off, for his hands, he has a splayed out, like, relaxed hand for his left that's currently on him. Then a normal gripping standard hand on the right right now. Then, for his other hands, um, for this hand, we have, um, for the left side, we also have this one. It's at more of an angle to hold his scalpel that he comes with. Um, but yeah, it's like it's quite small and hard to see, but yeah. And then the other side is a not a gripping hand for the right. And then um, for another le left hand is this one. Um, this is not how you get it. I actually cut these fingers off and then put like some marker, red sharpie there because... Um, I was like making a Halloween Kills hand or whatever before he get it gets it gets the wrapped up stuff whatever you know and then for alternate heads he oh yeah and then one more thing to point out he also came with this it's like a kitchen knife he did not come with this although I wish he did but the new Michael does come with this knife that's a lot like this anyways. For he he has a normal Michael head, that was my tablet, and then a another one where he gets shot. This is when he gets shot in the eyes, uh, by I think it's Doctor Loomis. I don't know. And then this head, which honestly I have no idea what this is actually. So if someone could tell me in the comments, you know, that'd be very useful. Yeah, it's like a white mask with blonde hair. I have no idea what this is exactly, but yeah. Um, there's not much else to say. Oh yeah, articulation, right. Um, first off, we have a double-jointed elbow, so great articulation there. Head-wise, it goes down that much, and up that much. Looks forward, side to side, all the way around pretty well. Just twist his head all the way around. Arm, all the way around. Goes out, bends back. Wrist. Goes all the way around. It's very difficult to do because the mold gets in the way, but it's uh, it's doable. Let me just <sighs> boom. See, and then goes up and back and forward pretty quite pretty well. The joints are a little loose since I've had this since uh, last Christmas, which is when I got it. But yeah, and then the legs bends out about that far. <sighs> They're kind of connected. So then leg. Then it bends back about that far. One jointed. Um, uh, knees. Knees have one joint. So it just goes back that far. And then feet. They don't really go to the side that well. Well actually they do. See like that. Or that. And then they also go forward. And back. But yeah. That's his articulation. Correct. Uh, that's his articulation. Um, yeah, that's all for really, oh yeah, and the box, first off is the cover art of the box, the side, the other side, the top, the little the do's, you know, um, and the back side, which shows you all the excess of uh, the stuff, oh wait, hold on, I'm gonna be right back, I actually forgot something, something I completely forgot to mention is that he comes with this, which is a pumpkin that opens up, and there's a skull inside. Pretty cool. But yeah, I completely forgot about this until I looked at the back. I was like, oh crap, that's that. So, the great thing I remembered. But yeah, he comes with all that, and I'm not forgetting anything. Um, on the back it says syringe, but I got that, when I got that, it, it was very flimsy, and I broke it. Be careful with that if you ever get this figure. Overall, 10 out of 10. Very good. And, uh, yeah, if you have some spare money, I definitely recommend you buy it. 
although I didn't. Anyways, hope you enjoyed the, uh, my review on this video. Bye, guys.